welcome back guys to another shopping haul you guys your girl has been out in these streets dipping and doing what i love doing and this is going to be a collective haul but i'm so excited to finally be sitting down with you guys i feel like it's been forever since i've actually just sat down and chatted up with the royal so girl grab yourself a seat Get comfy, grab yourself a little beverage of choice. I have mine in hand. I'm sipping on a little bit of um, lemon ginger tea. I have some, some of the vitamin C packs, but I'm doing the strawberry kiwi flavor. It's delicious and I have a, well I had a lemon spoon inside. It is absolutely delicious guys and perfect for a little precautionary weather. I don't know about you guys, but for me, whenever the weather gets ready to change, I always get like this little tickle. So we're gonna be proactive this season and get ahead of the game. Cause I can't be out here coughing and sneezing in these streets and folks thinking I'm walking around with the big C. So we're gonna cover that. So let me get a little sip of this tea and then I'll give you all of my fall tea. Delicious. Okay, I'm gonna set this down because again, I've got some things to share guys. I have been out and about, dipping and doing it, just doing this thing called life, and it has been an amazing journey so far. And I'm, thank you guys, if it's your first time visiting, thank you for stopping by. If you are a child and you are a brand new boo, you guys know, you already know I look so love and appreciate you, but I just wanted to hop on, sit down and chill and top it up with you guys and share with you my up and coming inspiration for the, or the inspiration for the up and coming fall season. I am so excited about this style and season. I'm excited about all of them to tell you the truth, but I just love coming up with new concepts, get a little bit of my old, add a little bit of the new, being a little creative along the way, and just sharing it all with you. So we're going to jump right in, guys. I'm going to start, first things first, I just, I love my people. Y'all are my people. And I have gotten so many um, requests or questions about the do. Y'all know I am a... Big hair, don't care type of girl. I feel like the bigger the hair, the closer to God, child. I love me some big curly hair. And when I saw this unit on, it was a TikTok. Um, I was, how did I say? TikTok made me do it. I saw this unit on TikTok. Young lady took it, baby. She revamped it. She made it do some things. I was like, I need that in my life. And it is by Sensational. It is called the Butter Lace um, Unit. I will, of course, have a link because you can find it on Amazon. That's where I got mine from was Amazon. So, of course, I'm gonna, you know I'm good for a good Amazon fine so this beauty is called the butter lace i absolutely love it it is so fun it's so easy i'm typically a crochet girl but this is just easy breezy vacation staycation type of vibe so that is what i'm rocking you guys um and another amazon find that i'm rocking is this cute little ensemble so i'll give you a quick little ootd this casual little comfy um, set guys, you know, I'm good for a good lounge set or a two piece set. So I got this from Amazon. Actually, I got it. Let me, let me back up. I got it from a local um, beauty supply store. But of course, I looked up the brand and lo and behold, they have it available on Amazon because they had some colors in the store. By the time I got there, a lot of them had been picked through because they're so comfy, very inexpensive. I think it may be like $25, $30 for the set, the pants, and the top. Very comfy, just stretchy. Love it. So I wanted to find the particular color that they didn't have in my size and excuse me i found it on amazon so i will have this outfit link in my description box as well all right guys since we're talking amazon we're going to hop right on into the haul with a couple of amazon finds now let me see how i want to do this. okay yeah we're going to start right in. a lot of you have inquired also about my other business which is event planning and a lot of times i talk to you guys about it but i don't get to share behind the scenes because y'all it'd be so much going on on the day of styling it's just it'd be a whole lot a whole lot of so your girl and that moment i'm in the moment and i'm trying to create the best possible moment or vibe or vision for the client you know that has selected me or hired me to do styling for their event so i'm in the zone so a lot of times i do get to share um, images or some videos on Instagram or Facebook. So if you're not a part of the Royal family over there, please connect with me over there because again, I get to share some things there that I can't always bring over here. So 
and someone on my team just happened to cap some pictures i may get a little video at the end but as far as being able to do a full-on video it's sometimes very difficult however many of you have asked about where i get where i source my items from and different things like that you want to know if it's a theme so i'm gonna give you what i can give you okay so for one event that i have coming up it's super cute and fun um safari themed baby shower for a little prince i'm so excited about it and uh, of course, when you think so far, you think all things tropic. So I had to get some more tropical leaves. So I picked these up from Amazon. This was, I think, an 84 piece set. No, this is a, for the 42 piece set. And I'm gonna go ahead and take it out because I don't want to have all that rattling, but it gives you three different, actually four different, no, it's three. Three different leaf patterns. Hold on, let me pick that up. Or maybe they're different sizes. Yeah, that's the same leaf, but it's different sizes. So you get a bundle of that size, a bundle of that size bundle of like the fern leaves and then a bundle of this and i think it's a really good buy i want to say maybe 12 dollars. again everything from amazon i will have it linked in my description box so i picked up um six bundles of these because we're going to make it look like a little jungle I cannot wait guys so i got that from amazon and again i'll have that linked as well another link from amazon that is event planning related is in addition to styling, I do the event of the balloon garlands and I'm kind of getting into like the balloon centerpieces. So I saw this, um, a young lady that I follow on Facebook that does, not Facebook, YouTube, that does a lot of balloon styling. Um, is it Designs by Lakeisha? I'll put her, I'll put her link, but she's amazing. She started out home decor lifestyle, but she has evolved. I mean, the girl is bad to the bone with the balloon styling. And um, I just, I'm inspired by her. I've, I've watched her and kind of have learned a lot of the things from balloon styling from her. And so one of the things that she uses was this little um, gadget. I'll probably, if I could drop a bigger picture, hold on, let's do this. Cause sometimes y'all, I don't be remember to drop those pictures to show y'all what stuff look like and y'all be mad. So. I'm sorry, charge it to my mama say charge it to my mind and not my heart, honey. Don't be my intent to leave y'all hanging. But sometimes just trying to get these videos up and edit it, it just be a whole lot, a whole lot of. But this is what it looks like, guys. It is a 16 hold um balloon measure so for like the different sizes balloons just to give them a nice even symmetrical shape so i just kind of wanted to step you know i'm doing them and they're 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 cute but you know i just wanted i want to perfect it and so when i saw this i thought i can do that because i just want to give a lot of add a lot more dimension to my looks and so again i'm going to be doing some centerpieces with the balloons so i want to just kind of practice and get that down pack or whatever so guys believe it or not is that it from amazon actually it's not it, but I'm gonna hold this other item or share this other item when I've introduced that collection. Cause you know how I like to do my, my hauls. I like to do them by themes and collections and all those things. So next stop, you guys, is going to be, I'm not even gonna call it a Dollar Tree no more. I'm gonna call it a Buck 25. So I went by Buck 25 and I picked up some things. Um, I went mainly for one thing and I just saw something that kind of inspired me to do something totally different for the fall. But what I went to pick up guys was this awesome um, cleaner amazing i heard about this on tiktok again i did a video not long ago where i shared an ink spot that was on my on this on this i'm sitting in the um the love seat but on the sofa and it was like three or four different spots and one of them was like really deep so i thought lord this is not going to come out and even though this is a performance fabric it was just a lot and so i went i remember the hack and so it was like you mix the awesome with um a little bit of dawn I think it was just awesome and done. Awesome done, maybe peroxide, I can't remember. But it was it was like really, really simple um, little ingredient. And it actually took the ink out of my sofa. And then I had an event not long ago, a couple of weeks ago, we had ivory um, linens. And I don't know, I guess a couple of the ladies got hot, honey, because <laughs> some of the napkins literally looked like they took the napkin and just wiped it wiped their makeup completely off they were totally soiled and i thought well before i throw these away let me just see if this will work on those and lo and behold i sprayed some of the awesome on those on that makeup and it took out every single spot i mean when i tell you there was foundation there was eyeshadow there was lipstick everything that they that you were on your face it was like literally like they just took their towel and just their napkin and just wiped all the makeup off but this took it all out. So I was like, I have to get more of this in my arsenal. So I went to go for that. I picked up, I think three of these just because I didn't want to run out. And then while I was in there, I don't know, 
I just saw this black scarf and I picked it up. I know what I was thinking because at the time I was wearing, I was rocking the crochets with my hair. Half my hair was in crochets. Anywho, I was going to use this as a headband, but that style is long gone. But it's just good to have a scarf. So if you need some little cute little scarves, but 25 is your place to go. So I picked that up. See, this is why you, you just be, anywho, got that. Now this is what sparked something new for me because again, you guys know that I like to stick with, now I may do different colors and themes in my house that's non-traditional, but if you've been with me for a while, you know that outside I always stick with a very traditional look for that season at hand. So typically for the fall, I keep it in the, the, the fall colors, oranges to chocolates, you know, that type of thing. But I saw this and it's amazing how one thing can spark everything and I don't know why it never even dawned on me before y'all because y'all know this is my spirit color and it is a cute little plaque that says fall blessings and it has the Tiffany blue it has the creams it has the softer oranges and which is really where I was wanting to go this holiday season um was in the in, the, in a softer hue of the oranges more leaning to what I'm which is why I'm wearing it but you'll see that later on in things, so just stay tuned. But this, guys, I just thought, this is so pretty. And it just got my little creative wheels turning as far as my outdoor styling. So be looking for a new outdoor styling video coming up really soon. And then I saw this one and was like, oh yeah. So the only thing that has me is that, I'm gonna see if I can take the grateful off because it's in a like a gunmetal or a I keep saying gunmetal I always call this gunmetal and it's not gunmetal it's galvanized is what it is but it's really pretty and it says grateful but I want to make that a soft gold or even like a chocolate like the picture here so we'll see now that would be a good idea if I just did like a chocolate glitter or bronze glitter because that's what that looks like on that fall blessing but definitely feeling this vibe so that is kind of where I'm going for the outdoor styling. So be looking for that. Again, I don't know why I never thought of this before or to even incorporate this color with the orange because if you didn't know, any der um, derivative of a color from the color wheel, if it's opposite each other, it's gonna be a perfect complement to each other. So that I like to say, orange and blue opposite of the color wheel, they complement each other well. These are both derivatives of orange and blue. It's gonna be cute, y'all. I said all that to say that it's gonna be cute. So come back and catch that. All right. Now, moving on. I don't know where I want to go next. Y'all are so excited. Okay, we're going to go to Hobby Lobby. I don't know if you're aware of it, but Hobby Lobby has started marking down their um, spring decor. This week, I think it's 75. Is it 75? Yeah, I think it's 75. I mean, we started 75 last week, but I, I didn't. I was so tired, y'all. I just, I just didn't go. And that, Lord knows I don't really need a whole lot. So these things that I have are actually intentional and necessary for the way I'm living or how I want to live. So with that being said, guys, I picked up a couple more of these um, rattan or raffia type of place masks. I like that darker, well, I like the mixture of the of the wood tones, but you guys know that I style with this for my um, tropical uh, Royal Oasis look. And I, we left some out in the rain. And so we are, I only, initially only had four and one of them got like, mold it was bad so we, we just really forgot um and left it out there and i wasn't able to after i saw the mold i just like it's it's over but i knew that they had some and so i in a place instead of placing just the one i went ahead and got two more so that i would have a setting of six and i really wish that i had gotten like four more so that i would have a setting of ten so i can have some for my conversation area and for my dining area but I'll probably try another um, another Hobby Lobby and see if I can find it. If not, it's not the end of the world, but I got these at 75% off, guys. They were $7.99, so what is that? A dollar twenty something like that, but not much at all. Let me see, eight and eight is 16, and then you add another five, so add um, 40 to that, so $2. I'm absolutely loving these. Super cute, and again, it's something that I will do over and over. Again, I'm trying to be intentional with the way that I shop because y'all, and this is gonna be a little chatty. So if you ain't with the chatty videos or the vlogs, then honey, this ain't gonna be the one for you because like I said, I ain't seen y'all in a minute. So I'm gonna talk to y'all while I can, okay? So during my spring purging, I came to some realizations with myself. Your girl was, 
obsessive or a hoarder when it came to, when it came to home decor. I had so much of everything. It was almost over, too overwhelming to even sort out and purge. It was just a lot, a whole lot, a whole lot. Of, but I was able to manage and purge quite a bit of things out of my decor. Just I didn't need it, hadn't used it in years, and, and it felt really good. And so I promised myself that moving forward, I would only buy things that were, you know, necessary for the way that I live because I am a seasonal stylist or something I like to do, but I don't just want this to be buying stuff just to be buying. I want it to be something that not only I'm going to use for that season, but it can be used for other seasons. It can be used for seasons to come. I'll never grow old of it. So that is how I'm moving forward with my shopping, but that don't mean y'all ain't going to see it. It's just, I'm going to be more intentional. I just be buying stuff. Oh, that's cute. Let me get it. She ain't doing that. It's got it because first of all, I'm running out of space to store it. And second of all, if I bring something else in here, that's <laughs> Too obtrusive my husband gonna put me out so i got to have some sense so with that being said guys this is a thing that i have had for a while and when i saw these i knew that i can add to that collection and just build on that because that's kind of what i'm wanting to do just build on what i have and i saw these towels guys at hobby lobby cute little sprinkles and you guys know that i do that sugar and spice thing um for the holidays super super cute they had three of these they were 7.99 at 75 percent off and then they had one with the actual ice cream. Had I saw somewhere like the donuts or the candies, definitely would have gotten it, but they didn't, but I definitely can work with these. They are all the pretty fun colors that I use for that tree. So cute, so fun. Yes, I got Christmas on the brain, but mind your business. So I got four of those at 75% off, okay? Also from Hobby Lobby, guys, I am planning again for the well, fall and for Christmas. So I'm going to be hosting Thanksgiving this year. I'm so excited um, to be doing it. Again, I think I, I think I skipped the year. We didn't do it the year of COVID. It was supposed to be my year, so it's my year. And I'm getting things for that. So I picked up these. Um, now, what I am loving about this new change from Hobby Lobby because it used to be a time when they never took their paper goods on sale, but since they alleviated the 40% um, off, you know, this regular coupon that you could use. I don't know if you notice it or not, but they have a lot more things that are on sale that normally were not on sale. With that being said, their paper goods was on sale. And so I picked up a set of these beauties. Now there was a time, and I still have some, that they carried this particular style in the copper. And I didn't see any, so I just went ahead and got the gold. But if I see some more in this copper color, I'm definitely gonna, or bronze, I'm gonna get it. So they were $5.99 guys at 50% off. And it's like a pack of 20. So I got three. I'm gonna go back and pick up a few more because again, I, I wanna have more than enough for it family and then i got the dinner plates as well these were 6.99 with 20 in the pack so got that got that okay and to add to my holiday style and arsenal guys i saw these and i could not resist so i picked up the um, polka dot of the gold and white these were 6.99 with 15 in the pack and i only picked up two but again i will be definitely adding more of those okay now, I have gone almost the whole year and hadn't really introduced my spirit color to you guys or styled my spirit color much at all. I think I did a little bit of the aquas and it may even been a mint for the spring in my bedroom. But if you've noticed, all year long I've been doing different colors. But y'all yeah, can get back to what I know and love. So when I saw these, I was like, oh yeah, we add these to the arsenal. So I picked up these beautiful aqua, mint, Tiffany blue, whatever color you want to call it, plates. It is... Um, 24 in this pack and they're $3.99. I only got two, but again, I will be definitely stocking up on those to add to the arsenal. And then I went ahead and picked up some napkins, 50 count, $2.99, 50% off. So if you're looking to do any like, you know, entertaining or just want to have something in your, you know, stash for when guests come over and expect whatever you want to do dishes, that's a cute alternative to do so. We still on Hobby Lobby, guys. I'm trying to keep this short and sweet, but I don't know. Let me give me something to sip on because I got some good stuff. Some good, good, good stuff to share with y'all. So hold tight. Y'all, this is so good. Absolutely delicious. Okay. Still at Hobby Lobby. I needed, uh-oh, some office supplies. I am working on the materials for my office. Right now, bedroom is serving as dual function, but gotta do what you gotta do. But even when we move, this will be the theme in my office. So that's why I'm going ahead and purchasing these things because I know what I'm going to be using moving forward. So with that being said, I picked up this cute little set of paper clips, um, little stick pens, and a little um, 
paper holders and it's in the cute little mason oh, it's not mason jar just cute little jars with a little cork top on it and they was $5.99 these were not on sale but I mean at $5.99 and you're getting three things with the little jars I thought that was a really good buy again it's functional and cute the way I like to live then I picked up the letter opener and the nice gold you see where I'm going with this I picked up the staple remover also in the gold okay I'm sorry this one was $3.99 the um, staple remover was $3.99 the letter opener was $5.99. Again, these are not breaking the bank, but just a stylish way to, you know, get your office in order. And then this is the, um, what is this, tape holder, um, tape dispenser, and it's $6.99. Super pretty with the, the acrylic with the gold. So I'm really liking this whole acrylic and gold vibe here. That's kind of where I'm going with that. And then I ha I've already had the scissors. And so I think I want to go back and add a couple of more pair because they've been using them for non-office things. But... I gotta get some more. So that is it from Hobby Lobby. Okay, so now. Okay, y'all, that's it, that's all. That is all for this fall shopping haul. So until the next video, I want you all again to stay safe, remain royal, and have yourselves a blessed and most beautiful, beautiful day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.